Welcome to episode 21 of Dire Power. <laughs> when computer disaster will strike. In fact, every year more than 7 million computers crash in the U.S. alone. So how do you protect your valuable files such as digital photos, music, and financial documents from hard drive crash, viruses, theft, lawnmowers, and other forms of disaster? Simple! You back up your files with Mosey. Mosey is a safe and easy way to automatically back up all of your files online. We'll even give you 2 gigs of backup space for free! That's enough to back up more than a thousand photos or music files. To get your free backup space, visit the Mosey website below. Mosey Online Backup. Funny name, serious protection. Visit mosey.bowerpower.net now to support Bower Power and protect your important computer files. Welcome to episode 21 of Bower Power. I, of course, am Paul Bauer, a.k.a. twitter.com slash Pablo. And today I got a real show for you. I know uh, the last episode, um, I got a few of you guys with my Rick roll. Um, but hey, it was April Fool's. What was I supposed to do? And yes, I am really sunburned today. I went to uh, my friend's uh, birthday party, which you saw in the intro, and totally didn't put any sunscreen on. So I am really sunburned right now. But um, let's get right down to why we're here. Uh, today I'm going to show you guys how to write a uh, USB uh, Bauer Puntu or a Buntu Netbook Remix image to your USB stick. And I know a lot of you guys are Linux experts, and you already know how to do this, so this show's not really for you. Um, you can continue watching if you want, but mainly it's for the tons of emails I've been getting from people who watch episode 19, which are where I show you how to hack Windows passwords. And uh, that was a really popular episode, so I've got a lot of people that are just now discovering Linux, and they want to know how to do some of this stuff. So I'm going to show you two ways, one in Windows... And the other way, I'll show you how to do in Linux here in just a minute. Uh, so first thing, we're going to get our uh, one gigabyte USB drive. We'll go ahead and plug that into my computer here. Underneath the mic. Okay. And uh, let's go ahead. And we'll just format it real quick. We don't have to do this, but I, I like to do it. We'll just do a quick format. Okay. So remember, we've got disk E for the USB drive. What I like to use is a tool uh, by a company called Roadkill. You may have heard of them. They have a bunch of cool free utilities. And the one I like is called Disk Image, Roadkill's Disk Image. And we'll run it. And you can either install it or you can just run it as a standalone program. What we're going to do is we're going to do a write image. Um, if you have a bunch of stuff and you want to back it up and create an image of your USB stick, you can do a store image. And that's essentially how I create um, uh, my, I, my IMG file for you guys is I use this tool to... Uh, um, after I get everything installed on my USB stick, I write the image um, using this tool. Or I'm sorry, store the image using this tool. So we're going to click write image and we're going to select our E drive and our source file. We'll browse to the desktop where I've got PowerPuntu 910R2. Now after this airs, I'm going to be working on uh, Ubuntu, or I'm sorry, Bower Puntu 10.04, um, which uh, hasn't quite come out yet as of this recording. It's about five days away. So um, 
that's a uh, Ubuntu 10.04, and then once that comes out, then I can start working on, on my customizations. All right, so we've selected our image, we've selected our drive, and we hit start. Yes. And we wait. And so now we have our image written. Click OK. Cancel that. And we're done. Now we have a usable PowerPoint 2 image that we can boot off of and do some cool stuff with. Now I'm going to show you how to do it in Linux. All right, and we're back. Now I'm going to show you how to do the same thing, but in Linux this time. Let's go ahead and take a look at my desktop. Uh, here you'll see uh, a glimpse at what Bowerpunt 2 uh, 1004 is going to look like. This is basically Bowerpunt 2 1004 beta here. And uh, I've got my Bowerpunt 2 uh, IMG file, and I've got my 1 gigabyte USB uh, stick right there. Uh, Ubuntu makes a program called ImageWriter, which I already went ahead and installed. It's basically uh, just an apt-get install USB ImageWriter. There we go. Password. All right. So we're going to select Oh, I think it looking for the the roots desktop here. Um, agent 014 desktop. Here we go. Okay, and we're going to do the Kingston Data Traveler USB. And write to device. Okay. And we wait. All right, and we're done. And now we have our USB stick, and we wrote it with Ubuntu this time. Um, now, if there's any other Linux tips, maybe you're a Linux noob, uh, you want us to uh, go over, um, go ahead and shoot us an email, info at bowerpower.net, or hit us up in the comments. Also, I want to point out, I just got some new BowerPower stickers uh, that you can go ahead and put on your car or the back of your laptop or whatever, just like uh, I've done here. And um, the way you get those is um, I've been handing out Powered by Ubuntu stickers for a long time. So if you go to stickers.bowerpower.net, uh, just send me a self-addressed stamped envelope. I'll go ahead and give you a bunch of Powered by Ubuntu stickers, and I'll throw in a couple of Bower Power stickers in there uh, free of charge as well. Um, but other than that, until next time, remember that here at Bower Power, information is power.